Let's try a bow for the mainland. For the wooden mall, I think it is. No, what am I using the mall, aren't I? So I'm using them all, I'm going to change this to mainland. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm going to try this. Then I'll go back to the mall. Where's my mall? There it is. Alright, let's try this. Fire a second here. <laughs> oh, you son of a... I'm actually going to stop it there, I think. Oh, I don't know. Wait a second.
somewhere I can shelter from this cold. Yeah, I'll go back in a second. thing comes out. Let me hang on a second, I need to go be on that. This isn't working. I'm gonna die anyway. This, this, I'm gonna call this an end. <laughs> If I can go back to that checkpoint, it saves him. <laughs> it's this weird, weird way, but it does it. Or maybe not. that bloody health thing, where's that? Down here in there, I've never... Fortunately I can see it, I just don't know if I can get anywhere near it. Oh! Ow! 
and that's where I'm going to stop. Okay, so um, let's go back to the main menu. Okay, so um, I've only played it for a brief time, or maybe not, I don't know, I don't know how long the demo is. The demo could last for another 24 minutes, an hour, or two hours, I have no idea. But I've just played a little bit of it, and it's actually not that bad, I mean... <laughs> I tend not to play these kinds of games, purely because I don't like all this kind of like sorcery and having to wield different magic and mixing this with that to produce, you know what I mean, all that sort of stuff. But I managed to grab the, the logistics of the game. Um, kind of the roll thing is annoying because you're so used to pressing WSA and D to move around, but that just rolls and rolls and rolls. So you've got to keep clicking with your mouse. Uh, can't fall off off um, ravines or anything, which is probably good, I suppose. Um, the creatures are good. I mean, you've got the flying birds; they're a little sods. Um, and you've got the the little like goblins and the wolves and those big things. So, yeah, it was good fun, and, and I like the fact that you, as you go along, you meet, you get these different, these things, you know, I mean, I could use that, but then I wanted the bow and arrow, but I had to sacrifice that. Uh, but then it managed to do it for me, in the way. These checkpoints are weird, because there was one point when I went past it, came all the way back again, and then when I got to it, it was checkpoint saved, so it's not like it's a, a s um, uh, each level. It just saves, which is kind of interesting. The fire's good, because it means you can't go too far without having to go back and get some heat. Unfortunately, I couldn't find the um, the health thing. And the thing is, I could do it, but then my little bar down here wouldn't sort of go back up again. So, you know. And the blood thing is interesting, because I thought you had to stay away from it, but you actually have to get the blood. And obviously, if you do, like, um, triple and multiple kills at one go, you get more blood. So then you can then transfer that blood to get more things. So, if you like RPG games, um, then I would get this. I mean, it's a bit expensive. So I'll say 35 quid or something. Um, so it's a bit expensive at the moment. Maybe it'll come down in price. It's only just come out this year. If you're watching it next year, as in not 2017, then so be it. But, um, but yeah, so it's only come out this year. Um, and I think if, if you've got all these different kind of things you can do and you can level up in different ways with that blood thing this game could probably last for quite some time if you go off and do these little things so yeah I, I definitely recommend it um, not something I'm gonna buy myself but I would recommend it to anyone who likes RPG games and this is a pure RPG that's annoying on Steam you go to RPG because I was trying to find demos before and then you end up in this sort of like shooting game it's like it's not really an RPG, is it? Well, I suppose it is, but you know what I mean. Okay, well, hopefully you've enjoyed watching my little uh, interlude into Vikings Wolves of Midgard. Um, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done. Uh, like the video if you if you like it. You know, if you don't, then don't. Um, write comments in the comments box below if you if you like this review or if you want me to do more or like this. Bear in mind that. Like I said, I'm not an RPG fan, but I can play them. I'm just not a big RPG fan. Um, and also, I have other uh, reviews in my my channel. I've linked them in this in this uh, video, um, as in the playlist. Uh, none like this, obviously, yet. But who knows? Okay, thank you for watching, and uh, goodbye.